Really, the headline from last night was that Donald Trump was trying to run away from comments he made on camera, on a microphone, uh, saying that he likes to grope women. And he did that by bringing up a group of women that he had dismissed in the past as ugly accusers, the women who say that Bill Clinton violated them in one way mm -hmm. or another. Is that what you call good change? I think Donald Trump's comments were indefensible. And what he did last night, having the women there? I, that is the way he chose to bring them into that debate, to have them present and to give them the opportunity to state their case. I think the comments on the tape of Mr. Trump were indefensible. And yet you do defend them by proxy of supporting him to be president of the United States. You can't have it both ways, can you, Congresswoman? I've told you, I, I agree with Tony Perkins. I share the concerns. And we have a binary choice here, Chris. You're going to have one or the other as president of the United States. They are both flawed candidates. I agree with Mr. Trump that we need to do something about right. ISIS, terrorism, national security. I have a major military post in my district. They want to see a change mm -hmm. in the way the administration has dealt with our military and the way we need to make certain that our commanders in the field are right. listening to and our men and women in uniform have what they need to do the job that right. they're expected to do.